Hi, welcome to another Game Boys of Awesome video, guys. Today's video, I've got some pickups to show you. I've got some stuff from Child Shop, some stuff from uh, Facebook, something I got from Argos, which um, is pretty cool. So, might as well uh, show you some stuff like that. So, first of all, I'll show you some Child Shop stuff which I got. Um, I've had some of this stuff for quite a while, which I didn't get to show you because I haven't done a pickup video for a little bit. So, I thought I'll show you the stuff I got from Child Shops, and um, yeah. So yesterday I went out just to have a look what I could find and um, spotted some awesome games which I've got already, or I've got one of them already, but uh, my one's really scratched and knackered so I wanted one that was complete again and uh, quite cheap so I spotted up San Andreas, and, which is a great game, San Andreas, GTA San Andreas or uh, Grand Theft Auto San Andreas, um, great game. Uh, I remember buying this when it first came out for like 40 quid back in the day or a bit more than that and um, I really wanted a complete one so this has got the manual and the, and the map and, and the poster and stuff in there which is really awesome for 99p I thought I grabbed one of those, I placed a copy that I've already got and I've got a really, this is really really nice condition um, this is some Heart Foundation I think this was and I was like yes I'm buying that because in CEX and uh, in CEX I think I spotted one up and I was selling it for like eight quid. So I thought, fucking hell, I'm buying it anyway. I'm not buying one from there. So yeah, I'm quite happy about that. And then to with that one as well, they had San Andreas, well not San Andreas, um, GTA Vice City, which is uh, another great game. I remember playing this one loads, putting in the cheats and that. Really fun game. And there, uh, that's that one. This one has got all the, um, it's all complete, it's got the poster and everything in there, map and manual, so that's really awesome, so I had to buy that because they're both complete, both in good condition, and yeah, well worth getting up, so I thought I'd get those. Um, them ones I got this week, these ones I got last week, uh, which I didn't get to show you guys. Uh, I've got a game here which I've never heard of before, and um, it seems quite cool, I don't know. I looked on eBay it goes about 6 quid and some people put them up to buy it now for like 10 or something. And that is this game here which I don't know what it says, I'm not sure it's, is it Jed, Jedi or I don't know, Jed Cons, I don't know. But I've got this game anyway, I changed the case out of it because I had a case with it which is totally enough. And um, yeah it was in this case here and I thought I'd swap it out of an old game which I don't really like and it didn't look like the original case so I thought yeah this isn't the right one, it looks like a DVD case so I've swapped it out with some one I've got and it is complete this game so yeah if anyone knows anything about this game I don't know what it's about um, it looks a bit like Pokemon where you have to battle up with like that uh, uh, battle I don't, know, I don't know if you guys can see that but yeah looks really cool but uh yeah, I haven't had a go on it yet, but I'm going to get around to it, which I'm looking forward to. So yeah, that's that one. And then another charge shot I went into. This, I got that, that one was, how much was that one? I think mean, that was a quid. This one was um, one pound nine p. I don't know why they had the extra nine p on it, but yeah. Um, I got um, this one here, guys. Uh, Destroy All, All Humans 2, which I've got the first one, but I haven't got the second one. Yeah, look, it says no, look, the price on it, see the price. Um, that's from you, uh, Age UK. This is in really nice condition. Uh, it's quite a funny game, I haven't been going it yet, but uh, I've looked at the back of it, it seems really fun. And stuff like that, so yeah. Uh, another one, uh, Charge Shot went to, I can't remember what I got here, I got it a while ago. I think I might have, no, I don't think I've shown you these yet, anyway. But yeah, uh, I've got some PlayStation 1 games here. Which uh, I've got this on three times now, but case and that. So picked up Harry Potter because I had the case. I think I put yeah, I had, I had the, um, a case for it with no game in it. So I thought I'd pick it up. So I might as well just get. Yeah, but I had no manual in it. So there's no manual in there. Um, but I wasn't too bothered about that. So yeah, put that down. So I'll just put that back in there. So I got that one, that was 99p, this was 99p2, which is Scooby Doo. Um, when I went into another tower, I spotted this for um, 50p in another charge shop, which I 
Um, I didn't pick up in the end because I thought I've already got it. So, but I may pick one up. I may pick them up again. I don't know if I see it again. But yeah, that's that one complete. Right, next up, I feel you this. I've got a new controller for my Xbox, which my one at the moment I've been using uh, is foot. Let me get show you. Right, I picked up I know why because this is my old one. I've started modifying it. It's an old mad mad uh, was it a madcap controller. And it's probably knackered, so I like glued it all up because it's why it was really dodgy, but I fixed it now anyway, it all works. Swapped out these uh, little little uh Got a joystick thing, can't really cool now. But yeah, I swapped my these RVs on them, and they're really horrible and um, plasticky. And I put the old, the old rubber ones on, and it works fine with them on as well. So I've just modified it a little bit, but um, still usable. But I just thought I wanted to get a new one, which is not going to die on me. I do have this other controller too, which I um, customed and got a new case for it. But I can't be asked to having to put new batteries or. It never holds the battery last in it, so I like to have a wire one that's not going to keep coming out. So I picked up a um, this controller here, which is um, pretty nice. It actually glows up, and this is the make of the, of the controller anyway. This is the make of it, as you can see there. I got it from Argos for, I think it was 17 99 something like that. And I thought yeah, I'd give it a go. I'll plug this in my laptop so I can show you how it lights up. Pretty cool. Well, I if it protects it. Anyway, I hope yeah. So there we go, guys. It lights up like this. Press the button on the back. Lights up like nice and green. So I thought I'd pick it up, and um, it's really nice actually. It's quite similar to the original um, original controller. Let me just turn light off. It's probably a bit bright. Quite similar to the original shape of the controller of the original controller. So I thought I'd pick it up, and for the price, I thought it was not bad. So yeah, I'm quite happy with that. So yeah, I've got that new controller. Put that back over here. Right, next up. Here guys, I've got... Uh, oh, yesterday, um, I put nothing on Facebook to say what I'm looking for. And someone come up with some games that I um, really are, uh, what I wouldn't mind having. And some I've already got, but I get rid of them to Jake and that, because he's really collecting, collecting for, the, for the system. So yeah, this is PlayStation 1 games in there and some other stuff. So yeah, I thought I might show you all this. Um, I got all this for fifteen quid, which I wasn't for. I didn't think it was too bad. So uh, I think I got like twenty odd games, twenty something games in there, and some controllers for the PlayStation One. So yeah, let's get into this thing, guys. So first off, I've got um, dinosaurs, uh, which I've already got this game. So this one's up for trade. Uh, I know Jake's got this one already. So it's got no manual. This one's up for trade, guys. Anyone wants it, let me know and I'll uh, send it out to you. Um, another one here which's got no manual, uh, which is um, Road Grats in Paris, which I've already got this one. So that one's up for trade. But I think Jake's having that one off me, I'm not sure. Uh, another one here, which is a racing game, which I'm not a big fan of the racing games, such as here. So that one's complete with manual and all that great stuff. Yeah. So I think Jake's having that off me as well. He seems to be picking up quite a lot of games off me because um, yeah, I help him out with mates. So give him help him out for his collection. Another racing game here, which here, which is complete, which I'm not having as well because I'm not into I'm not in for collecting place racing games. Um. So yeah. Uh, another one here which I really wanted to get, I've got it for the Sega Mega Drive but it's quite cool to have it on the Playstation which is uh, Mickey's Wild uh, Adventure which uh, one of the games was in the, in the list which really um, caught my eye a bit and this one is complete with manual and disc so I'm really happy to have this one so I'm getting quite a lot of good stuff for the Playstation 1 now and um, my collection, my system, I've got so many games. You saw my um, last video showing all my games I got. I've got loads now, so it's going quite well. Next up, I've got a football game which no one really cares about. There's no point showing it if it's complete because nobody likes them. But yeah, that one's up. That one's up for trading. I think Jake's having it for me as well because he's um, collecting for the PlayStation One. He doesn't care what game he has. Just gets any of them. 
I've got Harry Potter one here, which um, another one up for trade. I think Jake's got this on the radio, I'm not sure. Um, and uh, yeah, this one's got, hasn't got the insert, but it has got the manual. So I'm nicking the manual of this one because I haven't got the manual for my one. Another game, so I'm keeping this one. This is a, uh, was it, um, was it Rugrats Studio Tour? Um, this is here, Rugrats Studio Tour. So I'm keeping this one. This one is um, fucked, <laughs> but uh, it's got manual and it's complete with all discs and that. So, yep, that one I'm keeping. Yeah, I need to go through my PlayStation One games because I've got quite a few which I don't really want and what I do want. Right, this is another game that I want, what I really wouldn't mind having, what I looked in the bundle, and I was like, yeah, I'm having this one definitely. And that is um, Toy Story Race Racer, which. Um, is complete, got manual and disc, which is wicked, so it'd be quite a fun to game to play with my mates. So it's quite fun. Uh, another game which I'm gonna keep this one as well because I haven't got this one for the system. And I do like my roller coaster ty tycoon sort of games. And this is uh roller was it a uh, theme park. My I think I might have a go on it after this uh, video, see what I see what I can do. But it's quite fun. So yeah, that's theme park. So yeah, that one's you know pretty cool. The case is a bit knackered, but um, it's got um, discs, manual, and all that great stuff. So yeah, I'll swap out some discs of these uh, cases and that. Another good game, which I used to like playing these with my mate, quite fun. Especially um, the first, the, the second one, which is Smackdown. The second one is really fun. I've still got the second one on disc. And um, yeah, this is actually a four player as well, works with uh, multi thing. That's one thing I need to get for my uh, PlayStation collection. I knew I need the uh, multi four player adapter. Um, right, next up is I've got Jungle Book. I'm not sure what that says. Something Party. Grow. No, something Party, but yeah, Jungle Book. You see here. Yeah. Keeping this one. Looks like it should have come with a dance mat or something because you look in here. Got like a dance mat for the game. I don't know. So I think you have to play. Have to have a dance map for this game, but I, don't, I think I've got, I've got a dance map for the PlayStation one anyway. Disc is nice and all that great stuff. But yeah, that's all complete. Disc and everything in there. So I'm keeping this one. I do like my Disney games and movies. Next one I've got is how many times I've got this now? I've got this three times this game, which is Search for Rap, Rugrats Search for Reptile. Great game up for trade. Who wants it? I think Jake's already got some as well, so this is up for trade. So it's got no manual. But it's got disc and the insert, so that's wicked. Right, this one is in the came in the bundle as well for was it as I said 15 quid. I got all this lot for. I need to swap the case out for this one, but I got Crash Bandicoot uh, in platinum though, which is a bit of shame. But uh, yep, in platinum. Um, Jake's having this off me. We're, we're, um, we 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 would have other ones what he wants, so it's wicked pretty cool. So that's that one. Um, right, next up. Got more games coming out. I've got another Harry Potter game, which I haven't got, so I'm keeping this one. Um, looks quite um, cool. I know um, Lorna and my girlfriend's got it on PlayStation 1, this one. Not PlayStation 1, PlayStation 2. But, um, I don't know what the PlayStation 1 version's like. But this one is got insert, manual, and disc. So that's wicked. Right, um, another game. Which I just brought this game off um, Chris Shanks, uh, and I've got it in a bundle now. So um, this is, but this is a classic version. And it is Croc, which I'm um, going to swap out the disc with it because the one I got of Chris is a bit um, scratched. But it does work. The game does work, but his one's a bit. His one I got of him is a bit scratched. So I'm going to swap out this this disc, which is um, really nice condition actually, um, for that one. So I swap out a disc, and Jake can have the other disc. Which um, I don't think you'll mind. It works fine, the other one. So, yeah, that's Croc. Um, another one is Roller Coaster Tycoon World. Uh, was it? Not Roller Coaster Tycoon World, what am I about? Um, Tycoon. No. Theme Park World, what am I about? I keep getting. With Theme Park games, I keep getting confused with um, Roller Coaster Tycoon because they're the games that I used to really love, the Tycoon ones. But, yeah, that's the. Um, that's the. World, okay, well, theme park world. 
which I've already got this one, so that's up for trade. But I think Jake's having that one as well. All right, two was it last two last games? Oh, one more in there as well, actually. Let's get this one out as well. This game, I don't know what it's, I'm not sure what it's called. In I don't know, but it looks really weird. I don't know what it's about. I looked on eBay, it goes for about the people put it on buy now for 10 quid, but uh, that's that game. It's um, complete with um, manual and disc, which is pretty cool. So I don't know what this game's about, never heard of it until I got it in a bundle. Uh, next one I got is Toy, oh, no, Toy Story, what am I about? Uh, Bugs Life, which I've already got this game. So this one's up for trade, but I think Jake's having this one for me. So yeah, that's Bugs Life, which is uh, going to look pretty cool. Well, I think I got it. I don't know. I haven't checked my game. I've got so many of them now. Um, another, um, was it, Army Man game, which is, they're quite fun. This one's Team Ass Attack. I don't know what it says. Yeah, Ass Attack. Team Ass Attack, I think it says. Um, and this one's complete. With manual and that. So that's that one. Right, what else have we got in here? I've got some extra awesomeness which I actually chucked in in the deal. Or I think she, yeah. Um, what I've got here, guys, I've got a really, really awesome controller. I looked on eBay, it's not many, I don't think there's many on eBay. I think you could go for about 10 quid or something. And that is like a clear smoked. PlayStation 1 controller, but for the second PlayStation 1, which is a slim one, as you can see, and it's really nice, as you can see there, guys, it's like see-through. I'm getting quite a lot of controllers now for the system, <laughs> and um, I think I'm going to, as there's so many different controllers for it, I'm going to start collecting some of the controllers, like the different see-through ones, and um, I've got loads of different sort of ones, I'll just show you, when I do, I might do a video one day of all the controllers I've got, loads of different types of styles and stuff is really cool but they're all the they're all the legit ones not the um third party or second party you know but yeah that's um that's that controller here anyway guys so that's wicked i really like that controller very much um then i've got two original normal controllers which are here so I'll just unravel them up and so i've got another one another original controller and then they've got another one, another one here, what's a little bit of a but uh, yeah. So I've got all that place, all these PlayStation 1 games, as you can see, if I can lift up without dropping it. So all these PlayStation 1 games, uh, free controllers for 15 quid. So I thought that wasn't, wasn't a bad deal, so I thought I'd go for that. And um, yeah, I thought that was all good. So yeah, that's my uh, pickups um, for, the for this week. On Facebook, um, this woman contacted me as well about um, that she's got some old systems. I think she's got a SNES and a NES, um, which, which used to be her son's. I think she's about, she thinks she's in her 60s, but um, she wants to get rid of them. But her son's not, not sure if she wants to get rid of them yet. But uh, she wants to get rid of them because they're, they're in the way or something like that. She wants to you know, clear out the house a bit. So hopefully I can get these for a good, good price. When she sent me the pictures... I was like, fucking hell, that's, that's some really good stuff there. And um, hopefully I can get it for a good price. And hopefully I can sort it out tonight. Because she was meant to get back to me tonight, I think. Because I asked if she, if they worked first. And she doesn't know yet. So she's testing them out if they work. But yeah, hopefully I'll have a, a SNES and a NES soon. Which would be really good. I've got a NES. Uh, uh, not, not a NES. A SNES already, but I need a NES. So if I get a NES soon, that'd be really cool to get some games for that system. So yeah, hopefully I can get one and get a good deal out of it. So yeah, thanks for watching this video guys. Hope you enjoyed and I'll uh, see you next one guys. So thanks a lot and uh, peace out. Bye.